ever read this? You ever, uh, no, not read. You ever seen this movie here, Facing the Giants? I didn't know. Yo, you should watch this movie with you, your wife, and your two boys, man. This is a very insp insp in inspiring movie. Uh -huh. My mom put me onto it. And it has, um, there's a scene in the movie. It's a football movie. It's a scene mm -hmm. in the movie where it, it, it's exactly what you're just talking about. Like, if you reflect on it or if you realize, oh, I'm here, that's going to shoot you in your own leg. Right. But there's this part in here where they were doing the death crawl and the, and the coach blindfolded them and, and said the kid only thought he could do like 10 yards. Oh, you know what? I seen that. You I seen, seen that. It? No, I didn't, I, I didn't see the movie, but I did see that. I see that scene. Yo, the movie is incredible, man. Okay. It, it, it reminds me of what you're talking about right now mm -hmm. because, yeah, reflection is a big thing. Uh, and we do have to reset our goals once we do obviously get there. I've had a lot of my mistakes as well, my ups and downs, and it all came from exactly the same thing. And I think all successful people have that in common. Now, here's what I wanted to do. I wanted to find out, I know you did win a championship. Two. Uh, oh, oh right. excuse me. Okay, right. two. All right, two. You back to two. back. All right, two, two, one, you won two championships. What was yeah. that like? That was an awesome experience. That one, that is the one that I, I, and, 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 I, and I hope it's not killing me as far as where I'm going, but I reflect on it often because of it was successful. You know, I, I, try, to, I try not to dwell on my successes, but I, 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 I have to reframe to something that, that allowed me to, to have it. And winning those championships, man, it was, it was, it was I mean, the first one was, was awesome because, you know, it, it can't, it, it's a whole lot into it, man. It was, and, and this is one of the things that, that I, I learned from the year before. Um, and, you know, when, when, when we went to Miami, I was having fun, drinking and having a good time. But when I, when I went to, when I went to the, um, when I won my first championship in 2009, um, 2008 was the year that really I thought we were going to win it. Um, it was my first year and I'm, I'm kind of going back. Um, my first year trying, you know, becoming, given an opportunity to be a starting running back in a professional football team. So, you know, I, all I said was, look, just give me an opportunity. And, and just let me, you know, all I want is an opportunity. I don't care, you know, they paid the guy the other, more money than me, but for me it was like I just want an opportunity. All you want is an opportunity to, to, to lose or win. You know what I mean? Just give it to me. And he said, look, I'm going to give it to you. So I got the opportunity. I, I put myself I, – I was in the best shape of my life. I mean, I, I could not – I mean, I could not be in any better shape mm -hmm. um, than, you know, mentally and physically. Because, I mean, I knew, I knew what I wanted. I, I had my goals. I had two goals. I wanted to be the starting running back, and I wanted to win a championship. That was my only two goals for the whole year. And, and, and I knew I was focused on those goals. And, and again, if I and, – and my mom told me, and, and this is one thing that you, you, know, you might have known, man, I know. My mom was, was – she was a crackhead. So, and as a crackhead, my mom told me, Avi, you can do anything you want to do. You know, if you put your mind to it, and and from those words, I <laughs> promise you, there's nothing that anybody can tell me. If I really want to do it, I'm gonna do it. It's just if, you know if I want to do it or not. So I had my mind set. Okay, I want. I only got two goals. I want to go to the championship. I'm gonna win a championship. Um, actually, no, it was. I want to be the MVP of the championship game, mm. and I want to be the starter. That was my only two goals. Only two goals the whole year. So, so going into that season, I was like, okay. I, I, I don't know why I understood it. It was like, I don't, I don't, nobody ever taught me this and I, I don't think I've ever heard it, but it was like, you have to give up something to get something. Mm. You, you have to make a sacrifice. And my sacrifice was, I'm not going to drink the whole season until we win. And the beginning <laughs> of the season, the beginning of the, like the end of training camp, I have, I have my teammates like, yo, Avon, let's go out, let's go have a beer. I'm like, nah, I'm good, man. He's like, no, let's go out and have it. Let's have just one Heineken. Nah, I'm good, man. Now let's go out and you know have one. I'm good, man. So, but then the peer pressure got me. I had one beer. I had <laughs> one beer the entire year. The entire year I had one beer. We made it to the championship and we lost. Mm. Hurt me. 2008. 2009 comes around. My 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 only goal right now is to to win MVP of the Great Cup. I want to be MVP of the championship game. So in order to be MVP, you got to win. So I was like, okay, boom, uh, this is this is it. I'm, you know, so that the same things. I, I mean, I, I wasn't in the best shape because I had knee surgery prior to that year. 
So I, I was I was in good shape. I wasn't in great shape as I was a year before. Um, but what I learned was, you know, the sacrifice has to be, you know, God doesn't honor, uh, you know, he, he does, but for me, he didn't. He didn't honor the slip up. Me, you know, going against what I said I was going to do. And again, that's that's one of my you have to do what you say you're going to do for me. If, if you say you're going to do it, you got to do it. And right, I did it. Go ahead. No, no, go ahead. I, and, and, I, and I did it. I didn't drink the whole year. And, um, and we won the championship. I won the Grey Cup. I mean, I was MVP of the, of the championship game. Um, it, it, just was, it was just my moment. And it just showed me that, you know, if you do things right all the time, you know, God is going to show up. Absolutely, man. And-